This is a problem that I typically see students struggle with. First, they have to figure out that it requires U substitution to integrate. Then, it's choosing the correct U. A lot of times, I see students choosing a U value of t to the fourth plus one because it's the denominator. Then, when they integrate, or when they take the derivative, sorry, of u with respect to t, they get 3t cubed. And that's where you run into a problem because you don't have a t cubed in your numerator, you only have a t. So you know what? We need to trash that one and come up with a different u value. And this is a tricky one. It's actually a hidden arctangent problem. So that's what I'm gonna help show you today. So first we see that we have an a squared and then a u squared. Well, a is actually the constant, so a squared is going to be equal to one, and therefore a is equal to one. Then u squared is going to be t to the fourth. So u squared is going to be t to the fourth, which means the u value is going to be t squared. When I take the derivative of u with respect to t, I would get two t. Now you can see if I were to multiply over dt and divide by two, I get du over two equals t dt, and that is what I see right here, that t dt, so that sure looks good. All right, so now I can rewrite this. If you take a look at this, that t dt, I can replace that with du over two, and then this is equivalent to one over u squared plus a squared, which is going to be, when I take the integral, an arc tangent problem. I'm going to bring out the one half in front from the du over two, and now I am ready to integrate this. When I integrate, I would get one over a times arc tangent of u over a, and of course, don't forget our constant. Now I can replace the u and the a with the values that I indicated over here to the right. So I would have one half times one over a, which is one half, times arctangent of u over a, which would be t squared over one, or t squared, and then plus c. And that is going to be the answer to this integral. Thanks so much for watching. If you found this video useful, make sure to click subscribe so that you're notified when new videos are posted. Thanks so much for watching.